pick up she flies that's uh, she flies the filly in front on the inside she kicks away after they straighten and roman laurel wasn't able to peg it back and bell landy and last mr shoe she flies the leader on the inside of the corner led about a half and kicked away now two lengths into the straight from in second placing is Blacato and they're followed now by Roman Laurel a length and a half away getting into the clear followed by Squatters Green and Crescent but she flies well clear 200 to go the filly trying to make it three in a row Roman Laurel trying to cut her down on the outside but Morn hands and heels on she flies still a length in front he's had to go for the whip Roman Laurel won't pick it up though three starts for three wins to she flies Roman Laurel second third Crescent and here's trainer Ron Morn she flies and the Morn family, another win, three out of three. Yeah, it's exciting stuff. Well, especially in a big race on Caulfield Cup Day. Yeah, and uh, it was a strange state of affairs because of all the horses I've ever had. I thought this was probably as good a thing as I'd ever saddle up in a city race. And I was saying it tongue in cheek before the race because it's, uh, you're inclined to think you might be kidding yourself. But I'm pleased to say later uh, we weren't kidding ourselves. You were not. There was plenty there at the finish again, Ron. Yeah, well, this little filly sort of uh, hasn't had the belly galloped out of her at home. She only works on the wood chip track at Ballarat. And the only four gallops she ever had in her life is three runs in her races and the barrier trial at Sandown. And even uh, all of those haven't been under uh, full bore. So 